A 50 centimeter diameter wheel accelerates uniformly from 5 revolutions per second to 7 revolutions per second in 8 seconds. What linear displacement s will a point on the outside edge of the wheel have traveled during that time? Let's just make this a little bigger. Okay, so first we have to find alpha. We need the acceleration, which is the change in angular velocity over time. We're not given the angular velocity, but we are given the frequency, so we use this equation. Omega is 2 pi f. We plug in the numbers, and we get pi over 2 radian per second squared for the angular acceleration. We now find the displacement. We can start with theta 0 equal to 0 because it's not specified. However, we do have an initial angular velocity. We're moving at 5 re revolutions per second. So once again, we make the substitution. Omega is 2 pi f. And then we have our equation here. Here, let me get rid of this guy again. And we come up with an angular displacement of 96 pi radians. To find the linear displacement, or the arc length, that would be r delta theta. Now here's the trick, don't get caught. We said 50 centimeters, so you just want to go ahead and put in 0.5 meters. You know enough to, tr to uh, change it to meters. However, that's a diameter. We need the radius. So you cut that in half, and then your final answer is your linear displacement is 24 pi meters.